with its 11 highest TP incidents in the world, the World Health Organization, WH, with its 11 highest TP incidents in the world, the World Health Organization, WHO, listed Namibia as high TP burdened country. As Minister of Health and Social Services, I'm committed to leading this important charge, the fight to eliminate TB. We will work tirelessly to ensure that every person who needs the services, regardless of their socioeconomic status or geographic location, has access to quality TB prevention, diagnosis, and treatment services. We will address the social, the social determinants of health that fuel TB epidemic, including poverty, inequality, and lack of access to health care. The health minister stressed that investments in health remains key in driving progress in the fight against TB and leprosy. We must mobilize resources financial, human, and technological to support research and innovation, strength, strengthen health system, and expand access to quality TB services, especially in the vulnerable communities. This requires not only increased funding from governments, philanthropic organizations, and the private sector, but also smarter allocation of resources to maximize Minister Sangula, however, noted that investment alone is not a remedy, expressing appreciation to all stakeholders in the fight against TB. Stakeholders in the health sector commended Namibia for progress made in TB incidence rate reductions. The country has achieved a 28% reduction in TB incidence compared to 2015, thereby surpassing the 20% reduction of the end of TB 2020 milestone. With enhanced efforts in case finding strategy, the treatment gap has gone down from 42% to 25%. The proportion of people with TB estimated to die from the disease each year in Namibia has also dropped by over 30% over the last two decades. Finally, as been, has been previously alluded to, the estimated proportion of TB cases that are successfully diagnosed has risen by almost 30% in the last few years alone, showing that Namibia's efforts led by the Ministry of Health to improve diagnosis have borne fruit. Today, I am glad to learn that Namibia has recorded a decline in the number of notified cases of TB from 16,156 in 2004 to 8,100 in 2023. That is a significant achievement and uh, we need to applaud ourselves as Namibians and as a country. Minister Shangula also launched the health authorities 2023-2024 to 2027-2028 strategic plan for TB and leprosy during the commemoration of World TB Day. Look